focus. This is, this is the hub, the seat of my empire. It's where it all happens. Where the fabulous begins. And, and you know, it's a very personal space for me. It's got one of my favorite designs on the wall from my fabric line, and wallpaper line, actually, Which that I, I adore. just launched. And um, mixed in with a really great collection of photography. I'm passionate about photography. It's one of my big collections. Mm -hmm. And um, in here, really, I've given it this sort of 60s vibe. So I've mixed in all these great iconic images that really kind of show you a little bit of my own character. Now, are you doing any of the photography yourself, or is this? No, much? I wish. It's, it's just stuff that I love. Everything from, from the amazing iconic images of the Queen to this extraordinary image of Bridget Bardot. I adore, I love that. I love this, and I thought I'm going to put this right behind my desk, right behind where I sit, because it's this amazing party scene from the 60s with Andy Warhol and Edie Sedgwick. It's just kind of this fabulous vibe. Very, very. So I really love that whole, that whole moment. I love Mick, is that Mick Jagger up there? That's Mick Jagger up oh, the top, yeah. One of Christina, my favorites. Christina Aguilera, who was one of Beautiful. my clients. Elton, this is my favorite picture of Elton, actually. It's Elton on his private jet in the 70s. Nice, jet. Look at that, isn't that wild? Wow. So, so, you know, obviously I've got a lot of connection to these photographs. Cher, of course, another of my clients. So th there's a big personal attachment. This is where I absolutely get all my inspiration. I love books. I have to have books around me, not just for the essence of the way they look, which is what so many people do. They buy them, just put them on their coffee table. I read and look at these books and they inspire me for all of my jobs. So the library is very important to me. People are so inspired. And oh, I think that's you. really what you capture in your books. I could literally sit in bed and this would be my well, popcorn. Well, this one was literally written from the heart. I mean, if you read it, it gives you very in-depth stories. I mean, obviously, it, it's, it's wonderful because it's got uh, everybody's home in sort of a long lined up with their stories from my first job from Cheryl Teagues through to obviously Elton John and Cher and Kid Rock. But it tells you a little bit of the insight of how we all worked together to re achieve the kind of fantastic um, interiors that you see in there. Which are absolutely fabulous. Well, I fabulous. think they're fantastic. They, they <laughs> certainly are, darling. So I can promise you that. So obviously we have, we have an array of all the different work in the reception rooms. Well, I see a little William Sonoma home here as well. Yes, exactly. Right? You know, I love William Sonoma home. Yes. Always the best accessories. I agree. Yes, I miss the store in Beverly Hills, but of course, the online presence is fantastic. Thank you. So this is, this is all part of my new wallpaper collection, and I decided to do it in this wild tapestry, because I thought it was like a really fun way to showcase all of them. Well, this totally speaks Martin when you walk up. This, it's fun, this right? is you. Thank I you, adore. Thank you, thank I adore. You. This side is what I call the, the, the hub. This is where we design the fabric collections, the furniture collections, the accounting's done over here, all that important so stuff. So, as you can see, we've got many, many different fabrics that I have hand silk screen printed from my iconic um, Sultan Suzani, which has been oh, absolutely, absolutely an amazing beautiful. fabric for us, through to some of the newer Linen. ones, you know, very much inspired by my recent trip to India, this wonderful paisley, um, Turkish stripes. This is one of my iconic prints that you saw on the wall in my office, but in the multicolors. So this side of the line is a collection I designed for Schumacher, and the thing that's wonderful with these is all the textures from beautiful embroideries, silk over linen, to these incredible silk velvets. These are done, actually, these silk uh, devores are done in a company that Schumacher's worked with for a hundred years. To die for that Which is. is kind of amazing. You know, I designed things that I couldn't find in the marketplace that I really wanted right. to be able to use. And of course, it's just a bonus that other people are liking them and using them as well. So it's really a compliment, actually. It's wonderful. I love that. Yeah. So, so with all of those, entering this crazy business of design, what would you recommend for them to maybe get to a level as yourself? You know, I truly believe that for any young designer, they must follow their heart. And that means believe in themselves, believe in the things they love. Don't be a follower, be a leader. And that means that if there's something you're designing that you love, and maybe your mum doesn't like it, or your neighbor doesn't like it, or your best friend doesn't like it, 
It doesn't matter if you like it, that means somebody else is going to like it. And that, to me, is the essence of design. Be creative and really, really believe in yourself. That's the way you turn it into a career. Great advice. Great advice. Well, thank you so much. Oh, my darling, it's so lovely to thank see you. Thank you. You've been an amazing host. My darling, cheers to you. Thank, thank you so you. much for coming to see me today and for bringing your crew with you. It's uh, really been a pleasure. Thank you. A little bubbly. What's life without a few bubbles? Let's Love it. face it. Mm. Don't forget, follow us on Twitter and Facebook. And check out Designer Marketplace.